What's up YouTube, Lazy Lama here, and here we are back with some more anti-matter dimensions. Uh, due to a few people requesting it, I figured I'd turn on dark mode. I wanted to check it out anyways. Um, I do like it. Uh, it might be a little weird for some of you guys who aren't used to using dark mode in, in different things, but dark mode is a little easier on the eyes for people. So I figured, why not do it? Switch it up a little bit. If you guys like it, cool, we'll keep it. If not, um, we may switch it up in a couple episodes. But um, yeah, nonetheless, we can get our next... Uh, galaxy, Antimatter Galaxy. So let's do it. I believe, again, that's the one where we're going to push to the end here, if I'm not mistaken. Um, so let's do it. Let's get in here. Uh, we're off to, once again, the slow start of the beginning of the game. It's weird how, like, they're red like this. Like, I think that's how it was before. They just, they kind of show differently. I should probably be buying these. Kind of clicking this up. I don't really want to bring you guys through this again, but you can see our, our multipliers start higher now, uh, which is cool. Uh, plus, we should, I do want to stick out and wait to see what our, our multiplier there is going to be. Because we should have a better uh, a better tick timer, which I don't think we can get quite yet. Oh, we can do these. What, what am I doing here? There we go. Now we're making some progress. And I don't know if you guys pay attention to this up here, but this has got some funny stuff. I've been <laughs> been reading them, um, like, you know, in between, obviously, recordings. I haven't read any on recordings, but some of them are pretty funny. Uh, it's kind of interesting. Some of them pertain to people in the community and, like, mods in the community and stuff, which is kind of kind of cool. Uh like, there's got to be someone named Alright in the community or something, you know. Like, it's all, like, inside, like, memes and whatnot. But I find it interesting. Um, what's the funniest one you guys have seen come through? I'm curious. I'm curious. Let me know. I, I don't watch it all the time. I definitely have not seen them all. But I am I'm a little curious what, what you guys like the most. Wow. We're kind of at... I forgot how slow the beginning of this starts. Uh, but, again, I don't want to bring you guys through all this. We are going to... We, we did get a secret achievement, by the way. If you hit um, open the console, uh, that got, got me one. And then this, I think, just randomly came early on. But uh, as far as, like, achievements go, uh, we've been getting some more. I don't think most of these are making a big difference on things. But uh, also, our tick went up from... It went up two. The first time, I think it went up one. And I think it's supposed to go up two every time. I think that's how it's supposed to work. I might actually be better off getting this. Get one of these and then just focus on these. I think it's going to be better. Um, getting the multiplier here first is probably better than getting the multiplier here. Because once we get more of these, we can get that sooner. But uh, nonetheless, we're not going to... Oh, I should probably actually get that tick timer too. But uh, I'll come back. Um, we'll do a bunch of updates. I'm not sure if we'll get to infinity this episode or next episode. But you can see we need 80th... Or sorry. Oh my god. I think I did this last time. 208th dimensions. Uh, which is quite a bit. So it's going to take quite a while. Alrighty guys, so we're getting fairly close to getting this first infinite, and I was going to actually wait till we got to that, our infinity, before we, um, we did another clip and all, but I wanted to show you guys something how fast this game is getting. Um, so basically, when I um, come and do a dimensional boost now, uh, which we're 13 and we're going on 14, our next goal is going to be probably like, I think, what, 170, maybe? Yeah, 170, so watch. We're going to hit this, and I'm going to hold down the M key. And this is the game. We get up there. I click this. We let it go till it's above two. You see this bar go flying up. Uh, you can see we're already at 110. It's by the two times multiplier. I can just continue holding it. We're at 130. You can see this bar just continuing to grow. And yeah, you wait another maybe two minutes, and it's it's good to go. Um, Honestly, maybe remember like five minutes, but uh, not long at all. Basically, before we're at that one side, you can see we're actually really really close to it. Um, we're going to get it here in a second. I just haven't let go of the M key. And here's our first one, and we're good. That's it. Literally it. We are so close to getting this infinite. Uh, sadly, we're not going to get it in this clip. We're going to get it in the next clip. It's really late for me. I don't, I'm not actually going to be awake. i got to get to bed before I experiment with whatever this is going to turn into. But I'm very excited to say that we are going to be getting this real soon. Alrighty, guys. We are back, and we are flying through this game. We're getting really close to our first infinity, which I think we're going to get right in this clip here. I kind of want to do it with you guys. Um, so that's kind of what we're aiming for. Um, unless something crazy happens, we get stopped. We can do this as well. Uh, we'll do it. I don't know if we really need it, but I might just slow us down for a second. But we're definitely grabbing this. Definitely grabbing our first infinite here, or infinity here. Uh, and bam! All right, so the world has collapsed on itself due to excess antimatter. Uh, is, that, is that it? Which is big crunch button. Bam. All right, so looks like we're back to the beginning. It's kind of like... Resetting. We're actually out of galaxies. It set us back to zero. So it looks like we're back at the beginning of the game. We have this tab called... Let me buy some of these, actually. It started with 100, too, which is kind of cool. Now, let's buy that off the bat. So, all right. We have one infinity point. Um, 
Oh god, I'm gonna mess this up. You guys are gonna yell at me. All right, so we can only buy one of these two, or we can buy something in here. First dimension auto buyer. Yeah, it looks like it costs. Yeah. You know, we don't really care about auto buyers, I don't think, at the moment at least. So normal dimensions gain multiplier based on the time played. Currently three times, okay. And then increase the multiplier for buying 10 dimensions. Wait, increase the multiplier for buying 10 dimensions? Oh. So it'll go up, ooh. Because we're so new, I feel like, I feel like this is better. Yeah, it's, it's only 0 0.2 extra every time. But you think as we get going, it's going to be so much more. The question is, will it add up to be more than that within the time we get a next infinite? So I'm assuming you get a new infinite point every time, or possibly multiple. Uh, we also have things called challenges, which I was, I was told. Um, reach infinite for the first time, which we've done. I think we can continue to do it. People are saying to do number eight, which I don't know if we'd go down and over or back and forth to eight. Are they numbered? Hmm. I'm going to have to read through these. All right. So I looked briefly into it and thought about this and um, looked through the comments again just to kind of verify. And people are definitely saying eight. And if you actually look at these, you can see that it just goes from uh, second, third, fourth, fifth. Um, and it's talking about the auto buyers, which I did find out we actually already have. So if any of you guys went and already commented that, I got you. I rounded out. Anyways, I went through and read it. <laughs> But yeah, so it looks like that people are suggesting this one first, that it just kind of gets, it's faster, basically. Uh, plus, we'll get the 8th Dimension Auto Buyer, which I feel like is probably next to the first one. It's probably the best Auto Buyer to have. So we're going to do that um, simply by just hitting Start, I think. Uh, this will start you over just with infinite upgrades, achievements, uh, blah, 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 blah. Okay. So it starts us back. Cool. So... It does say we're complete. It says we're running this. So I think if I click this. Oh, can I not go back to normal runs? Does, I think it auto puts me on one. Okay, that's interesting. I guess these are faster and going to unlock us the infinite points a little sooner. But uh, if we come into, uh, sorry, inf uh, infinity here, we can go to our upgrades. And uh, I'm like thinking more about this. And like, I really think this is going to be better. In a sense, theoretically, this is better. But it takes so long to get that upgrade when we can get this right off the bat. Um, to like all the dimensions, which is the only reason I'm leaning more towards this. I know you guys are probably gonna yell at me for not taking this one. Uh, no one really said which thing to get first from what I was, what I caught, unless I missed something. But we are going to take this for our infinite point. We're gonna do that, which is gonna be just a straight multiplier on that. We lose that. The auto buyer. Um, I have it set to buy on ten. You can see it actually already did that, and it. I guess it's enabled. Um, I did enable it, but you can't really see if it's enabled. I don't think in here. Does it say anywhere? Is active. Okay, yeah, a little checkbox. Um, cool. So that's going. Again, break infinites to get... Yeah, we don't can't do anything with that, and we can't do anything with that. Not going to even worry about what those are, but... Anyways, let's pop into this. Again, this is supposed to be faster. So again, this challenge, just to read it out for you guys. Um, dimensional boost and galaxies are useless. Um, sacrifice resets. Uh, reset everything. Um... But it's more okay. So I don't know. We'll see. I'm, I'm very, very curious. So this whole sacrifice button here, um, which we probably want to wait till it's two or up. Still, I'm assuming, right? Um, I don't want to do it wrong, but oh, it auto bought that. I'm like, wait, why can't I buy this? I forgot it's gonna auto buy that on me, which is fine. Uh, I'm okay with that. And this will just unlock the eighth one. Um, I wonder if it'd be worth doing early. Probably not. We probably want to wait. I'm going to look more into that. Um, I'm going to see if I can find a little bit of information on it before I go clicking it and such. Uh, see if there's any information on it. That you know, It's interesting how this is supposedly faster. Uh, people were saying to do it till I had like six infinite points, I think, is what someone said. Um, but I guess it's the easiest challenge to do, and it's better than the normal runs. These other challenges seem really difficult. Some of them look like, how are we supposed to do that? But obviously, with all the, all the infinity upgrades, I guess we can get are going to make a big difference. Uh, and I'm not really sure why 6 is the point where it's easy. It's probably just all like these one upgrades. I haven't read through any of that stuff. But uh, I'm excited to see how this plays out. I'm definitely excited to see how this goes and what we make of this. But uh, anyways, I'm going to play through this a bit. Uh, let me show you guys a little bit here and there uh, coming up. But uh, for now, I'm just going to kind of do my thing and grind it out. 
All right, so I just want to go with the final little update for uh, this progression here. Um, so I've grinded through all this. We got to the eighth dimension. We still couldn't do the dimensional sacrifice. I reset, and it looks like I can do it now. Um, I actually check box came in. It's still red. I don't know why it's red. And it says it only boosts the eighth, but the idea of the challenge is to boost all of them. Um, also assuming, which makes sense, is that we do not do the dimensional boosts anymore. Um, or the galaxy thing. We're literally just looking for the infinite on this exact run. We're not resetting anymore. It's just all a matter of doing this. Um, is what I'm assuming, as it says straight up, boosts and galaxies are useless. Um, they have not given any, any multiplier. But nonetheless, we should see these multipliers, for example, this go up to double that. So it should be 222. Or actually, triple that. So 333-ish, I guess. A little more. But um, we should lose everything as well. So I'm kind of curious. Let's see how this goes. I guess I still can't do it. Gives you the option. Your dimensional will remove all your. Did they just not change the tooltip? Maybe you can't do it till you get to the eighth. So let me get to the eighth, and we'll come back and try that again. All right. So you can see I've got my first eighth dimension. I'm curious how this works. Again, it says it's more powerful. Um, looking at it, it's dimensional boost and galaxies are useless. Sacrifice resets everything, but is immensely more powerful. So it still says like the ten times. Uh, it does seem to be 10 times faster than it probably should have been, but I've never really had it that early, so I don't really know. But nonetheless, I should probably shouldn't have bought that yet because we're going to do this. But we can see these multipliers, they should all jump up a ton. Well, they technically went down, but... Um, wow, if I could have went bad if you do that where you can't afford anything. We could have possibly not been able to afford anything, right? What would have happened? Ooh, I got to watch that. Can you mess this challenge up by doing that? You may be able to. It's already that's already a higher multiplier, um, and that's higher than it, like started at. So this should, in the end, be good. Uh, but nonetheless, I'm gonna grind this challenge out a bit. I don't know if I'll show more footage of the challenge or not. I'm not really sure how long it's going to take. I'm just gonna keep pushing. Um, by next episode, I may be be done with it, and we may be moving on. Or actually, we'll probably have to be repeating this challenge. I think, um, like I said, someone said like till I get six um, of the infinity points, wherever they're at. These we have to get six of those. so we have technically one, uh, but we gotta get six of them before we can get through this. So I'll probably come back at the end of this. Uh, we'll start next video at the end of this again, depending on how long this actually takes. But anyways, if you guys enjoyed the video, please smack the like button. It really does help out with the channel and uh, support to the series, guys. Uh, you guys have been great with it so far. I think once again, thank you guys so much for that. And uh, yeah, as always, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.